What's happening, Cam? This is your boy CB Hunts, and yes, we're back with another review of the of the uh, Fat Thor Wave. And next up the bat is your main man, uh, uh, Tony Stark. We'll get you a chance to go open him up to see how he is, I, like, out of package. And I can tell so far this is going to be a nice one. So when we get back, we finna, we finna, we finna check him out right now. And now, we got the main man himself, Tony Stark, in his last suit that he wore in Endgame. Man, I'm telling you, this figure looks badass in the box. Man, that they can tell like by the like the paint job they got with this is just, just, just outstanding. You see on the on the box, we got the uh, the Marvel Legends series logo right there. Top of the box, got the Avengers A. It's part of the Endgame wave with the Iron Man mark. I think that's eighty four or five from it. I don't really know. You see the picture of Iron Man on the side of the box that he used in part of the back. Same as well. Got his bio right there. If you want to read it. Pause it. There you go. We got the fat door right there. Sorry about that. That's my neighbor's going out to their car. And got every person in the wave and part of the box. And we about to open this bad boy up. Cause I can't wait. I'm excited to get him a box so I can see what all he, 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 he uh, has to come with him. So we'll be right back. Actually comes with the open hand. Along with this one, so the camera is sh sh shaking. Zoom in. There it goes. Open with the open hand. Now you can put the X in. Take one of the effects. Put it in the open hand. To like so. That down. Like so. Show off him sh sh shooting off the effects. That's with every Iron Man that it, that it, it comes with. Going on with like the bro thing is the other arm of Thor. Exact same way. Got the got his sleeves, part of his his uh, robe, long sleeve for his his sweater underneath, and his gloves that he got in his hand. When different with this one, it comes with extra hand. Where he goes off in a time movie. We haven't seen the movie Endgame, man. I'm sorry. There's going to be some spoilers in this bad boy. So, oh, hit the camera. So, this is his time jump piece that he has on his hands over his glove. Where we go. Why is it shaking so much? This is a time jump piece. Uh, a little sloppy on the detail in the paint. But it's alright. I'm not going to be having this on his hand anyway. And so the same thing that goes comes along with, with uh, this Iron Man is the Hulk, the Hulk gauntlet comes in two pieces. The actual hand, the actual hand that shows all the jewels in it, everything, whatever you can put it on the um, the the Smart Hulk in that wave. Where we, where we got them, and you can be able to put it on that exact same hole. Next to pieces, arm sleeve to go over it, and it'll make it tap it with the full, the full glove. Kind of like that. Wish it would have gave an extra face of the actual Hulk. But, you can come with the main man himself. It's Tony Stark, Iron Man. Basically the same kind of mask that we're using. So I think from the other two-pack wave with uh, him and Sp Spider-Man. So along with that, I like the way like the color schemes they got. They got that. They got that marble red in it. They got the gold paint 
with the, like a dark gray. Wish they would have like a silver though. I know they have silver here, but I wish they had more like a silver part of the suit. I think it'll stand out a little more. Like the gold laced all the way around the figure. It's real clean. Gold and everything. I like the way the boots are. I feel like this is not a nice figure though. But you know me, you know how I am. So with this glove here, I might do a little custom work. Yeah, I might I might I might just do, do, do a little custom. And I might show in a picture afterwards after I'm done with that. And like Tony, he got his head left to right. Can we move his head up and down? His arms could go that high. He got a, a, a bicep sw a swivel and he has the double jointed elbows. Got no wrist articulation, but he can turn his hand left to right. And he got an upper waist diaphragm. Does have an ab crunch, can't really bend too far. Bend too far back. Legs and go out this far. And it splits. And it got double jointed knees and kick that far back. Got an ankle hinge, go that far down, that far up because of the hinge. Then it has ankle pivot. I'd say this is a good uh, figure for the uh, Iron Man in game. I like the way it looks. Wish it would have came in a few extra, few extra parts to re to really have the movie. I kind of figured they didn't want to add that in there because 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 they didn't want to spoil anything. So this is my quick review. Oh, I almost got something. The actual size comparison. You can see. This is with Tony Stark, who is his first armor and his last. Ugh. Rest in peace, pal. Rest in peace. And another size comparison to the very first Avenger and the last Avenger. And with also the uh, Captain America from the exact same way. Now, this is my review of the Iron Man Mark 84, 82, I can't, can't really remember, remember the number, but this is the last suit that he wore in that game. This is my review of the Marvel Legends figure, Iron Man. Peace.